how to make salt dough. Um, instead of clay, if you don't have it at home, you can make clay with uh, these ingredients, almost like cooking. So I'll show you what we need today. We need flour, salt, vegetable oil, some water, uh, tempera paint. So in a large bowl, you put a cup of flour, half cup of salt. So first you mix salt and flour. Then add a um, tablespoon of oil. Mix again. Slowly mix water. until you get nice clay consistency. I got this. I didn't use all the water, so it depends on the temperature. You can adjust it and take it out onto um, Wax paper. Once you get nice dough like clay, I want to make flowers today. So make tiny balls. Make this. Make six of them. One. Two, three, four, five, six. So once you get nice six balls. We're gonna make flowers, so one, put one in the middle, and then two, three, three. Like this, and then you just, and then you just push down. Flour. Or if you have any um, cookie cutters, you can use this too. You can flat this. And same as cookies, you can just push down. You make it nice and flat. Push down with the cookie cutter and take out the excess. Or you can make anything you want with this dough. Once you've made all the shapes you like, put on the cooking sheet and on the pan and heat up your oven for 250 degrees and we're going to bake about one hour. If you don't have oven or you don't want to use the oven, you can also air dry for two to three days. 
So after you leave these for a couple of days or you bake them in oven for an hour for 250 degrees and let it sit until it's totally cooled down it'll be very hard looks like cookies but it's like hard as a rock So once it's ready, you, you put the piece of newspaper or something underneath so it doesn't get dirty and take out these ornaments. And you now it's ready to paint. Or if you don't have paint at home, you can use markers to color just like this. And color these. Or you can paint. You need brushes and some paints, any color you want. And just, just paint on top. Maybe on the side too. If you want to paint the back, you can wait to dry the front. So leave it on the side. I'm going to paint the flowers. So maybe paint in the middle. Change the color, always clean the brush and wipe. You don't want to put too much water with the paint. So dry the brush and then paint. Paint carefully. Try not to mix with other colors. Okay, okay so I paint them all. Like this. This I did with the marker, orange and uh, red. This is paint. All right, so this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed the project. Thank you so much for watching. And I will post more videos soon. So please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.